Why you must become the authority and the leaders in your niche? This is a very special topic and it really resonates with me so much that I want to share with you the principles why you need to become the authorities, become the top of mind of your niche. Many years ago when I first started a business, well, I'm, I'm a newbie, you know, and what I do is that I go to everyone on Facebook and I just like PM them and message them just to try to sell my service. And I realized that that actually gives you a very bad position because you don't have the bargain power and it makes you look like a hardcore salesman because you don't make money, therefore you have to go until that stage, right? And all the bargain power is on the customer hand. So you become someone that you need to fit into their criteria and you have to, you are the one who are in a lower position that have to like meet their requirements instead of them coming to, like to meet your requirements. Let me explain. Once I understand the principle of why I need to become the leaders and authority in a niche, right? That actually totally changed my business and it changed the way how customers react to me, which is I managed to pull in the ideal clients that exactly that I want. You instantly come, you instantly, you instantly goes from someone who try to hard sell your service to someone who really pull in people that come to you. And when people want to come to you and they want to like contact you, they want to find out more from you and they are willing to come to you, right? This instantly gives you the holding power, which they know that you can help them. And the next thing is how they can afford your service. So that's the power of actually being the authority in your niche. And the journey to transitions to from someone who keep pushing your service to someone who managed to attract people to come to you, this is a process that you need to prepare yourself. How to do it? The most basic is to keep publishing content and keep demonstrate to people out there through the knowledge that you have, through videos, through the Facebook Live. And you have to have case studies, testimonials to keep proving to them that you know what you're doing and you have the capabilities to help them. And it's just down to the matters of whether, whether they are ready to come to you. They might know you, so it's down to whether they are ready or not to contact you. And when they are contact you, it's down to whether to they can they afford your service or not. But it makes your life so much easier. It makes your business so much easier that you just have to wait. Like seriously, when you do the work consistently, there are really people coming to you every single day. Like really want to ask for your help, ask for your help, ask for your help. And as long as you know how to do closings, closings is another skill by the way. So you manage to attract people to come in and you manage to do closings and you have the holding power at the same time it's like a, like it's like a jackpot that actually that you just wait for people to come on a daily basis to, just want to seek for your help and want to work with you so i hope this video gives you a little bit of insights of like what you should do next like instead of just keep pushing keep hard selling like keep bragging like really turn the table around and and think, start thinking, how can I attract my ideal clients to come to me by constantly publishing valuable content on a daily basis so that I would be able to attract the attentions and it reached to a point that I will be able to manage to, okay, I can tell them that, okay, if you are really in struggle right now, please come and like speak to us and you just wait for the response, they will reach. They will come eventually when you've done the homework right.